Hello. Today, we're gonna try out the coloring book challenge in The Sims 4. Oh, yes, we are. Now, this challenge was created by Sid Max, so shout out to her. I mean, you guys probably already know her. I know her. Not personally, but in a parasocial way, I know her. Anyways, if you don't know what the coloring book challenge is, it's basically... Well, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I don't really know what the coloring book challenge is about. Because, to quote my third grade teacher, she's a bit slow. Well, she said it in the region, but you get my gist. Um... <laughs> But what I do think it is, is that you make a whole house in complete white. No other swatches are allowed. So it kind of looks like a coloring book, you know? And then when you're done with putting in all the white furniture and the white wallpaper and so on, you then go in and put in the real swatches. So it's, um, you know, kind of like a coloring book. Yeah, you know, that's what we're going to do today. And by the way, this section of the video is sponsored by the EA, not the whole video, just this little section right here. They're not paying me to say anything, but it's just for legal reasons. And I don't want to get sued. But anyways, some of you have been asking if I have a creator code. And guess what? I have a creator code right now adul and my code is just nora not gaming just nora like this and why the name is just nora and not just nora gaming is because when they ask me what my code name would be i panic and i just said just nora i mean now the code is already meant so i'm not you think i'm gonna send an email asking about a different name no and i'm also legally obligated to say that um what is it using my creator code directly financially supports me yeah, <laughs> that it does. So if you do know what a creator code is, it's basically when you purchase a Sims 4 game, you click on the little button on the side and then you type in my little code. And when you make that purchase, I get 5% of something so i hope that made sense because i don't i don't know i'm gonna get kicked out of this creator network so quickly no what is it called i get five percent of what you purchase no that i do not <laughs> i do not get five percent of your game the amount of money that you paid for that game i get five percent of that so am i gonna film that all over again no i'm not i cannot be bothered i am happy with it i stand for what i said so there's my creator code use it if you want to if you want to support this channel and no no but anyways let's start shall we or we freaking shall what all right so here i am on me little lot whoa and yesterday i thought that i would be productive and build a shell but the only problem is that i made this shell at like 1 a.m so you know it's kind of bad and second of all i don't remember what i did so this is gonna be pretty exciting uh, <laughs> so um this is the layout of the house <laughs> this right here is the entryway then we have a bedroom i do believe a kitchen and dining right here and then we have a little office and then a bathroom and then something what was that i don't know and then the living room oh i think that was a laundry room maybe and as you can see, this house has only one story and one bedroom. So you know what that's gonna be? Very fun. <laughs> no, I really wanted to try out a single story house because I haven't done that in a while. And I wanted to make a house for a single lady just popping up on there. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Let's uh, begin this challenge. <laughs> now, I know that there is different ways to go about this challenge. One of the ways is to do the entire house in white first and then come back and recolor everything. And then the second way is to do one room at a time, you know? You make one room white and then you you color it and then blah, 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 blah. so which way am i gonna do it i don't know but let's find out as we go <laughs> i have no plans oh yikes okay well let's start with the exterior first and um this is gonna be hard i can already feel it in my bones what do i want to do first maybe put this on the foundation ah oh, yes that was a beautiful choice by nora and then i have to put on my little roof and what roof do i want to go for maybe something like this nice and then <laughs> we can maybe go like that you know nothing too fancy and then oh the roof tiles oh no but i do think that this one has a good variety of colors it looks ridiculous right now but maybe maybe it will look good okay now for the wallpaper what do we want is this considered white i mean what else would it be gray probably <laughs> but maybe i can go for this wallpaper i mean yeah you know what that wallpaper very cutesy very demure i must say i'm gonna keep that wallpaper and then this outside bit that can be some stony moments that definitely isn't white but it's in the white category I'm not cheating that much but a little bit <laughs> now we need a door the most important part of the house what kind of door do i want maybe some fairy tale ish liba dish all right so this door is from cottage living so maybe we should have some cottage living windows so then we at least have a chance of having the same wood color you know maybe we can go for these sort of windows that's cute that could be something oh what type of window am i gonna have up there that's a pretty large space huh interesting what can nora find out what about some realm of magic windows maybe that could be a vibe and then on this side we could probably also 
also has some realm of magic windows and that is a wide window on the side right well that's not my problem today but now i want to put up a little dormer here little dormer and oh can i find a white dormer i mean we have this but the roof isn't white and i think that kind of ruins the illusion you know what else do we have that's completely white i mean i can't have that no 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 i have to make my own oh i know boy all right i tried to put up a little dormer with the half walls and the roof trick and ugh, it's not working it's glitching out as you can see right here <laughs> so it's just gonna be that you know and we're just not gonna look at the sides we are not and then i thought on the side here i could have a little fireplace no i'm gonna have a little chimney you know just for some ambiance wow it's beautiful <laughs> now for the back of the house i do believe i want a little patio and i do think i want a door to come from the kitchen is that seems reasonable you know you know just a little teeny tiny one like that maybe and then the roof i was uh, thinking of having a little fun roof what is a fun roof well it's something hear me out i kind of want the roof to follow the little curve that i've made on the main roof you know so if i just oh not like that but if i go something like that <laughs> i mean isn't that something i think that looks lovely i <laughs> think so <laughs> right i do think we need some more dormers because it's kind of flat we need something to spice it up and i cannot be bothered to make another dormer like this one okay that takes so much time and it doesn't look good okay if it looked good i would have probably done it but that doesn't look good so i'm gonna compromise i'm gonna put up these on the back okay please please let me have this one you know what i can't tell if that looks ridiculous or not because of all the white i don't know uh i'm gonna keep that i'm probably gonna regret that but i'm gonna keep that all right so let's start with some landscaping shall we that sounds like fun what kind of plants do we have oh that's not much is it do we have any rocks oh these are the only rocks we have right i see how it is what am i gonna do then what if i put up some plants just in front of here that sounds like a genius idea and then i can what can i do i can like secure the plants in with these rocks maybe if i just maneuver them around with tool mod and stuff maybe something will happen we shall see we, we shall see where nora goes with this because i don't know right now i do not all right i have put in all my plants and wow it looks very white that it does i have no idea if this looks good or bad because everything is just so white ah i don't have any contrast so i, I don't know all right so now i was kind of thinking of making a little pathway moment as you do but we do not have any pathing none is white so i have to make that myself with some tiles and what would look good maybe this and then i can just bring it over here maybe <laughs> that does not look good how can i make that look better how about some stones and then i just make a little little something with that oh this is gonna take all day i don't even know if that's gonna look good but maybe i will maneuver it around with tool mod and stuff and maybe it will look good who knows i'm kind of worried for nora all right i have put up me rocks along the pathway and now i do realize that i have a gap there but i'm gonna fix that up <laughs> right now i'm thinking of putting up a little fence in front here just for fancies i don't know if that's gonna look good maybe if i put in some plants and stuff then that will just look 10 times better but who knows everything is just so white i don't know what's happening right now i really don't know okay jokey so here are my plants it looks so freaking white <laughs> what am i gonna do now i think i'm just gonna put up some more plants everywhere just around the house i mean look at nora go planting all them plants she is amazing isn't she oh she is all right so i'm done with the plants around the house there they are in all its glory and now i do feel like i gotta add some more details to the exterior of the house because it looks kind of empty so i think i'm just gonna put up some plant boxes is that what it's called plant side window boxes i don't even know maybe also some outdoor lights and um more details i don't know oh maybe also those um ivy trails that could be fun i'm gonna add that too because i can do whatever i want <laughs> i i really can and then in the backyard i'm thinking of putting up a little fence to just fence it all in and i'm sorry guys the backyard is not gonna be this long this is a weird shaping lot weird shaping lot weird shape of a lot so maybe it's gonna be this shape i mean that could work it could what can we have here to make it a little bit more exciting because now this house is looking like this house you know <laughs> so ooh, what about if we put in a little greenhouse i indeed could i mean oh i do like that that is so cute i'm keeping that that was a good idea by nora and then for the inside of this little greenhouse i can put up this that seems about right you know i kind of want this woman who lives here to have a little witchy vibes witchy vibes without being a full-on witch you know she just has those vibes but i think this little thing fits her well i do think so and that cactus looks so weird in there it looks like a little melon but i <laughs> i do like that <laughs> all right so here is the little greenhouse it's really adorable i do like it 
Okay, so in this little backyard, we need a little pathway that goes from the greenhouse up to the patio. And then I am going to put some rocks around that. And it's going to be incredibly fun for me. It really is. And it was indeed very fun for me. I had no words. I had the time of my life. Okay. <laughs> what else can we have in this little backyard? Ooh, we can have this little clothing line. I don't know why, but it fits in here. And then we can put up this little table with some chairs. You know, she deserves a little sitting moment out here. Okay, she, she does. And then I do think I'm going to put plants all around this backyard because we have discovered that this lady loves her plants. So Nora's going to put up all the plants and it's going to be so fun for her. She's going to love it. And here is all the plants that I put up. Just a bunch, a bunch of plants. Look at this place. Plant city up in here. Whoa. Okay, now I am going to do some cheating. I, I am. You may not like this. I don't care, but I need to do this for my mental health. Okay, I do. And that thing is to put some pathing, some paint just around here. I know it isn't white, but listen, this place is going to look so bad without it. Okay, it, it is. And I'm sorry, but that's my limit. So here is the final result with the paint and stuff. Oh, wow. It, <laughs> I, I have no words. This is very white. But yeah, this is the final result of the exterior and the landscaping. Oh, me, oh my. Right. So I am going to start coloring in everything now on the outside. Of course, I can't color anything in on the inside because I haven't done anything on the inside yet. <laughs> Let's do the wallpaper first. I think that's important. What color do we want to go for? Maybe this? Oh, okay. I think I like that color. Do you like that? Oh yeah. Now for the big question, the windows. Will they match with the wallpaper? I have my doubts, but let's try. Oh, I mean, it does kind of work. What about the door? Uh yeah, that door kind of works. Oh no, what about these windows? Oh no. Oh, is that too much? I don't know if I like that or not. I, I don't know. All right, what about the roofing? Wait, oh, hold on. No, go back now, go back. I changed up the roofing for a second just to see how it looked, but then I regretted it and then I didn't put in the original roofing. No, 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 this is not cheating. I just, I'm dumb. You saw me put in that roofing at the start, right? That's the one I'm gonna go for. And let's see how that looks. Black? No, brown. Ah, oh no. Maybe this was a bad idea. Maybe I shouldn't have gone with this. Why did I choose this roofing? This is kind of bad. I have no words. Well, what about these windows? Oh, okay. We have these windows. Or do we want this sort of window? I'm not really sure. Maybe I want those windows since I'm already here, you know? Ooh, and then what about the chimney? Please say that the chimney will look good. Okay, we have this brick. Oh, I mean, yeah, it looks decent enough, I think. <laughs> and oh no, now I have to change the color of all of these freaking stones. That's gonna take forever. Do I really want to do that? I don't know. Let's go into the backyard and I have to change a lot of colors here too. Oh, yikes. Alrighty, I am back and I have put in all the colors on this place. Oh, we are wow. Oh, me, oh my. It looks so freaking different. Look at this. It looks like a completely different house. I don't even know what to say. I um, quickly realized that this greenhouse has to be completely white because these windows do not have a brown swatch in the checkered thing of things. So it just had to be white. But I think that is okay. Maybe. But here it is. A whole shebangity boom. Wow. What a house. <laughs> Alrighty. So now that the outside is all done and dusted, we shall step on inside. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do for the inside is I'm going to do the whole entire inside white first and then I'm going to color it. Because if I just go room by room, it's going to be so easy for me to quote-unquote cheat, you know? Because then I see what the wood colors are looking like in here and then I can do the same or better in the other rooms, you know? So I don't want to do that. I want to have fun and I want to struggle. So what I think I'm going to start with first is to put in some flooring because why not? Maybe I can put in some flooring for horse ranch because they have some cool swatches they do and these rooms are going to be bathrooms so i'm going to come back to that later don't want to deal with that right now now for the wallpaper i think i'm going to make this very easy for me and i'm going to use the same wallpaper <laughs> in the main rooms at least that's what i'm going to do okay wallpaper complete for the main room and uh what room are we going to begin with first maybe the kitchen what am i oh this is so hard okay you know what maybe i'm going to go with the counters from cottage living because i do kind of like those and i know that they work with a lot of stuff that i do know i think i'm going to go with this frame it's also from Cottage Living, so I feel like that's gonna match. <laughs> and then the stove, you know what? Cottage Living, it got to work. And then we need a little dining table that's gonna be right here. And I'm gonna go for Cottage Living again. I promise you, I'm not gonna go for Cottage Living on every single furniture, but um, here we are. All right, so now we have a lot of dead space here. So what can I put there? Because I think if you put up more counters, that's just gonna look weird. Yeah. You know what? I think this might work. I mean, you're not gonna be able to use that, but um, I like it. And that's all that matters. Let's get some cabinets up, up on this thing. And then under the cabinets, I'm gonna go for these shelves because they fit in nicely. And she can have some little nicky knacks on that. There we are. Some nicky knacks. Wow. <laughs> and now we're gonna find some more decorations for the rest of the kitchen. And what? What a nightmare. What a freaking nightmare. 
nightmare. <laughs> All right, so this is how it's looking so far with the kitchen. You know, try to make it a little cozy. And now I'm gonna find some decorations for the walls. And oh boy, how, how am I gonna do that? Interesting. Well, first of all, I'm gonna put up this carpet if I can align it right. I'm so worried about the color swatches on that, but um, uh, that's not my problem right now. And then, oh, I can put up this shelf. Nice little shelf for them. And then to make a little separation from the kitchen to the living room, I'm gonna put up some bricks. I don't know. Oh, all my stuff disappeared. Well, great, but I fixed it. <laughs> and uh, oh, now the curtains. Oh, yikes. My worst nightmare, the curtains. Maybe I can just go for something like that. You know what? I think that could work, actually. Let's move on. <laughs> and I think we are going to move on to this room, which is the bedroom. Wow. And maybe, but just maybe, I'm going to do something a little bit controversial. I'm going to put up this uh, wallpaper. <laughs> I do not remember the color swatches of this. I must say, I do not. So this could be really horrible. It could be. But let's get in the bed. And then a little nightstand. What about this one? <laughs> that could be a nice little nightstand. It has potential. And then over here, we need a little dresser. Ooh, I kind of like this dresser. But this dresser is from the Realm of Magic pack. And um, the Realm of Magic pack, they have some interesting color swatches. They do. So why am I making this so difficult for myself? Well, I'm going to take that risk. I'm feeling bold today. And here are my little nickety knacks. All right, what, what can we put in here? Maybe a little table. I think that could be fun for us. What about this table? That's nice and cute. Maybe. Ooh, and I was uh, thank you for decorations. I really want to put in that little record player. But it's not here. Are you kidding me? No, no, no. They had a white swatch. Hold on. I'm not cheating. I'm not looking. Where is it? That one. That is white. You cannot convince me that that is not a white swatch. I'm using that. Sorry. That is white. I'm using it. It's not my fault that the Sims team is bad at the color swatches. So yeah, it's not my fault. But yeah, that's looking very, very cute. And what can we have in that little corner right there? Maybe we can have a little poof moment. I love me some poofs. <gasps> what if we have this little mushroom? That could be kind of cute. Or is that too much? No, I like that little mushroom. I'm gonna keep it. And then for the curtains, what can we do here? Nora, please tell me. Oh, what about these? Oh, that could work. What was I so worried about? That works fine for me. I think this is gonna be a cute little bedroom if I do this all myself. I even put up this one. You might enjoy that. All right, let's move into the living room. First of all, we need a couch. What about, ooh, does this have good swatches? I do think so. If I can remember correctly, any chances for that are slim. Anyways, we need a little TV. Is that the only TV? What? I'm not cheating, I'm just looking. You can't tell me that that isn't white. It's obviously gray, but I know it's white. I can't each see anything that's white. Moving on. <laughs> and then for the carpet, I do really want the carpet from a Love Struck. Yes, I, I love that carpet. But where is it? Hello? The carpet isn't here, but it has a white swatch. I know that. You can't tell me that that isn't white. That's not even gray. That's white. I'm getting that. I mean, again, it's not my fault. It's the same Sims' fault, you know? <laughs> Okay, so over here, maybe we could have a little library situation with some bookshelves and you know what? Would that be a fun idea? Maybe. Okay, let's put some more decorations here. What do we want for them? Who knows? Okay, maybe we can have some plants just to spice up this place. And then we can have this cute little salt lamp. I mean, it isn't completely white, but it's white enough. And then we can have this little terrarium thing. What is this? Crystalline vivarium. That sounds like a word that I would make up. <laughs> and then on this table, what can we have here? What would be fun? We can have this little radio thing. And we can have a little candle too. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm going blind by all the white stuff. I cannot see anything. All the items are just mumbling in together. I need some contrast and I need it now. All right, so that was it for the living room. I mean, we got some decorations here, some little pictures, and some more pictures, all that good stuff. Now, what you may notice with this living room is that it's not decorated as properly as I usually do. And the reason for that is that my game freaking crashed in the middle of it. And while it was crashing, my OBS, which I'm currently filming this with, also crashed. Yeah, so I had to quickly come back and just put in the decoration that I remember that I did. But I am... I am just so mad to do it properly right now, okay? I am. And I'm gonna come back to this later and do it properly because I do not want to do this all over again right now. I'm just too mad. Well, okay, we're gonna move on to this hallway. What can we have in this hallway? Maybe we can put up a little table right there. And then we can put up a mirror around there that I have to lower down with tool mount. Perfect. And then I need to find some white decorations to put on there on that freaking table. It's oh my gosh. And then maybe we can put up a little poof here. Oh, but that poof is from Nifty Knitting, which is pretty well known for having 
using obscure colors so is that a bad idea but it fits in so perfectly in there it's very nice it's very approachable very demure i'm gonna keep it and then for this hallway we need a carpet as well so what can we do there we need to do something at least maybe i can put up this carpet then we also need some sort of front door carpet and oh that is no oh my gosh what can i do i mean what freaking carpet is gonna match you know what i'm gonna put up this carpet again i know that we have the double carpet <laughs> but i don't know what else to do i i don't know what to do <laughs> It's probably gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. And then I can put up a little light switch. Because that's white. But I can also make it fancy. And how am I gonna do that? I'm gonna take this one. And I'm gonna size it down and plop it on there. And use my tool wand to scooch it back a little bit. And there we have a little light switch looking all fancy. Wow. <laughs> Alrighty, so that was the hallway. Very simple. Very nice. I do wonder how this is going to look. I, I do wonder. And now we're gonna move on to the bathroom. And I'm gonna put up some flooring and some wallpaper first. And you know what? I'm gonna go very simple and just put this up then we can put it in a little bathtub and i can put in the toilet and the sink and i can also squeeze in a little mirror and then you know what i'm also going to put in the normal bathroom naked and eggs because why wouldn't i what would a bathroom be without some naked and eggs you know all right so on this wall i'm thinking we need some towels and then we can have some sort of shelf up here with some bathroom naked and eggs you know that could be nice for her if she can reach that high up who knows and oh i also need a little bathroom mat how could i forget that and bathroom mat place nicely all right so that was the little bathroom it's looking so bare at the moment but i don't know if i put in more stuff right now it's probably gonna look bad when i put in the colors but again i don't know but you know we're gonna move on to the little laundry room and what are we gonna do in here i need some tiles apparently this is white for quoi? i think i'm gonna go with this one i don't know why but i just love that flooring and then i've just put up the same wallpaper as i did in the bathroom because yeah okay moving on <laughs> and bam 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 i'm putting in my washer and dryer I mean, that was beautiful. <laughs> then I think I'm going to put up some counters with uh, just some normal laundry stuff on there, you know? This, this is a normal laundry room. Wow. And here is the beautiful laundry room. I even put up this little shelf, which is from Cottage Living. And it's the corner piece. That one. And I just think that's magical. All right. Ooh, we only have one room left. And it's the office. And a plant is sticking through the wall. I'm going to pick that later. And I do now realize that we have a chimney, but we have no fireplace. And I do not know where to squeeze in a fireplace. Oh, yeah. Yikes. Well, I can squeeze in a fireplace here. Beautiful. <laughs> Alright, so then I do believe I'm gonna have a little couch in that corner. I think that would be cute. Is that the vibe I'm going for? I do think so. And I'm also gonna give them a computer and some little decorations. And what can I give her? <gasps> that could be fun. <gasps> so she can be a plant mom and a crystal queen. Oh yes, that is cool. I like that. Okay, that, that's the vibe we're going for. And yeah, <laughs> now I need to put up some more stuff on the wall. And what can that be? Oh, I can put up this new uh, wall collage from Love Drug. I do love that and oh she also deserves a little carpet this one okay now for the fireplace we need to spice it up a little bit spice it up with some brick maybe i think that can work what else can i do i can put in these stones just to create some ambiance over there <laughs> okay so over here oh i can put up this little tray thingy oh that's gonna be so cute look at it and then maybe on each side of the window we can put up those shelves that look like books but they're not a bookshelf but they're shelves made of books these ones and then i'm thinking of putting the new candles from love strike on there is that do you feel like they fit the vibe? The vibe. And they're not here. Why? Do not mess with me right now. Excuse me. You cannot tell me that that's not a white swatch. Or maybe they think it's silver. That could also be a possibility. But look at the books underneath. Those are considered white. But not that one. I am revolting. Well, anyways, I'm gonna give them a little carpet as well. And some very random picture frames on the side. I do very much hope that these come in a good swatch. Because otherwise, it's gonna be awkward for us. Okay, so now I'm done with the whole house, really. Am I? Oh, no, I have the living room. Jeez Louise. I have the living Living room. So maybe I can have a radio here. Have a plant here. Then I can have a little candle there. Oh my gosh, turn around. Turn around. What can I have down there? <gasps> maybe. Oh my gosh. I know that this wasn't in the plants, but maybe she can have a cat. Because that's kind of witchy vibes. And she was supposed to have witchy vibes. You know what? I can just give her some little footballs. Maybe these ones. Okay, now I also need a little cat bed. Oh my gosh, it would be so cute if the cat was sleeping in front of the bookshelf. But that means that that won't be usable. Okay, if you're gonna download this house, which you're probably not, you can just scooch this over to the side, okay? Then I need a cat toilet. Oh, where can I put that? Oh no, I don't have a space for it. I really don't. Okay, what if I just scooch the cat toilet in here? Maybe that could work. Maybe it could be in the hallway. No, that's gonna stink up the place. But oh my gosh, this is the worst part about building. It's when you have to do stuff over again. And especially when it's decorations that you have spent so much time on maneuvering around in little places. And then you have to do it all up again because it's so fun. Ugh. But you know, life is beautiful. It is. Okay, but with this little square abyss, what can we do with that one? To hide that up? Maybe with one of these shelves? Oh, 
Ooh. I'm in a real pickle now. Is that wood swatch gonna match with the other wood swatches? Oh no. I think I'm just gonna have to take that chance. I think I really have to. Okay, last touch. I'm gonna put up a carpet here. A teeny tiny one. A teeny tiny one. Yeah, what if I use the realm of magic? Right. Because I've used it there. Okay, I'm putting all my trust in that carpet. Oh, maybe it will work. Maybe. And then what if I have a little carpet in here too? So her feet won't get cold in the morning, you know? In the morning time. All right, now for real skis, the coloring can begin. And I am so nervous. I don't know why I'm so nervous, but I am. What if we start with this flooring? Oh, okay. Just put that in every single room. Oh, no. I picked some horrible bathroom tiles. What is this? A bright blue. Orange one. This. Why did I pick this one? Okay, I'm gonna go with that. You don't have to color in everything, you know? I hope not. But anyways. Oh, wow. Just putting in another shade of flooring has made a huge difference. Oh, wow. Okay, which room are we gonna begin with first? I think maybe the kitchen. Why not? <laughs> this is the wallpaper. I mean, I can start with this one, actually. Is that good? I honestly don't know. Okay, so the counters. Do we have a good color? <gasps> oh, the green one. Okay, I like that. I like that. That. That's good. And oh, the shelves. We don't have green shelves, but <laughs> maybe just brown. What about the carpet? What? Oh, oh no. Why did I choose this carpet? This is bad. No. <laughs> okay, I gotta be this watch. Oh, oh no. Uh, I have no word. What have I done to myself? Now for the most important thing, do we have a good color swatch in these feeding bowls? Eh, okay. Good enough for me. <laughs> All right, now I know that the stuff is on the ground, but each time that I paint the walls in this house, they float down. So I have to do that in the end. <laughs> okay, so this is the kitchen. Doesn't look half bad. I mean, I put all my freaking faith in these carpets, but none of them, none of them look good. Here I thought I was being smart with these uh, carpet choices, but no. Anyways, here's the kitchen. Let's just start painting the bedroom, okay? Because <laughs> I am scared. What wallpaper do we want to go for? Oh, this is dark. What about this one? That could be something. <gasps> oh, I like that. I made up my mind. I want that bed. That is so cute. And then the dresser. I'm so nervous for the dresser. Do we have any good colors? That could be good. And then this table. Oh no. I know. Why did I have to choose that one? This is not gonna match. Whatever I do. What if I have that? Oh no. I'm so confused. I don't know what to do. Okay, maybe I will have that shade instead. Maybe. And then the mushroom. Do we have a good mushroom color? We have a pink one. I do like the pink one, kind of. Maybe I'm gonna go with that. I don't know if this is a therapeutic for me or not, actually. Am I healing my inner wounds from this? Probably not. All right, so here's how the bedroom is looking. Wow, wow, wow. It's so freaking weird to see this place have color. I mean, oh, wow. This is such a cute room. All right, let's move on to the living room. What am I going to start with first? Maybe the bookshelves because I'm so curious about this situation. I think we're going to have brown bookshelves. And then do we have a good brown? No. That is bad. Why didn't I put something there? Why didn't I put this little hippo there? It's too late now. That would be cheating. Gee, Louie. Right. Not going to question it. Do we kind of like that color? Does it match with anything else? Do we have that one? Does it match with the cat? Uh oh, I have no idea. I mean, if this cat bed doesn't match with uh, anything else in this room, I am going to cry. Because why did I put this in? Oh no, doesn't really match. All right, so this is the living room. I am going to fix that mess up afterwards. But here is the living room. Oh wow, it looks kind of good. It has some few mistakes. <clears throat> this one. But other than that, it is looking nice and dandy. All right, all right. Now we're going to move on to the bathroom. What are we going to do for the bathroom? Ooh, what about green? Oh no, why did I choose this toilet? This is horrible. Oh no. Oh, Nora, what have you done? Okay, now the wallpaper. What if I just do that? Will that work? I'm not really sure. Oh, yikes. Oh, okay. But wait, change of plans. I feel like this is a little bit better, uh, I think. We get some yellow in there. Maybe a little pink or maybe a dark blue. No. Okay, what about this? No. I, oh, no. I don't like anything. The rug is also horrible. Um. So here is the bathroom. I do not want to discuss it. I had a horrible time. Let's move on to this room. Oh, okay. Okay, the washing machines. What can that be? Maybe yellow. That could be fun. Or maybe the counters can be yellow and then these can just be normal washing machines you know or gray or black or beige no oh my gosh i do not know okay what if the counters are these dark brown ones and then the washing machines can be yellow i mean sure i'm moving on i want to be released from this misery <laughs> okay so here is the laundry room i have no idea if i like this or not because i've been staring at white for so long that every single color just disturbs me i don't okay oh we have one room left no we have two rooms left the hallway okay i'm gonna do the hallway first why did i choose the the exact same carpet. What was my plan with this? Like, for real, what was my plan with this? Because this is looking ridiculous. Okay, well, if you're wondering, between these clips, I am sitting here in total silence. I can each believe what I've done to myself. Yeah, now, can each believe it. Ah, oh, the little fishing lady is cute, though. Okay, now this little poof. I am so scared about this little poof. Do I even want to know? Uh, oh, what am I supposed to do now? I don't like any of the colors. Oh, okay, I'm gonna have that in white. Oh my gosh, this hallway is terrible. Why did I pick the same carpet? Oh, I can't. I'm 
never gonna forgive myself for that. But here, here it is. Here's the hallway. Oh, I should have had something there. Do you see that now? So, you know, got my fishing lady. Yikes, this hallway. Okay. Let's move in here. And please, let it be good. Oh, maybe I can help Pepper. And then put in some bricks. Uh, I don't like any of them. Shoot. Why didn't I just go for normal brick? Why did I have to go for that one? Whatever. What happened to my column, by the way? I don't want to know. Let's do the couch. Okay, I can go with that one. And the carpet. I don't know. Hmm, I don't know. Oh, okay, now for these little pictures. <laughs> I am kind of worried about them. Yeah, not what I wanted, really. This is not the vibe. Let's not speak of that anymore. Let's uh, go in here. Ooh, we can have this, this, a nice computer, and a nice chair. All right, I mean, this flower, I do now realize that this flower isn't um, really the vibe for the room. <laughs> I mean, this room is supposed to be like a little dark academia-ish inspired. And then this little girly pop flower pops in, you know, it's a... Uh, <laughs> it's a choice. And oh my gosh, I do not like this carpet either. <laughs> that doesn't match with anything. Maybe just green? I mean, green is a weird color to match with the wallpaper. The pie bar? The wallpaper. What have I done to myself? You know what? This can be the funky corner. With all the funky colors, we're not allowed to ask questions in the funky corner, okay? We are not. Alright, I have colored in all the rooms. And I do now realize that I put up this carpet very weirdly. Like, why is the carpet like that? And why did I place the couch like that? This is weird. This is weird behavior. This is not normal. <gasps> I forgot to put in the coffee table as well. I had space for that. Why did I do that? The things you don't see when everything's white. Right, I'm gonna fix up all the things that fell down, and then it's time for a little house tour. Oh, it is. But alrighty, here is the house tour. Wow! Here is the front garden. I do love them plants. I do love them. I mean, I'm happy with it. Do you feel like? I think I'm happy with it. Some of it, at least. Oh, here's the side of the house. Oh, no. I don't think I like this side. It's too much. Yeah. But anyways, here's the backyard. That is kind of cute, though isn't it? I'm happy with the backyard. I mean, look at it. It's so cute. And here is the inside of this little greenhouse. Oh, la la. La la. <laughs> it's so cute in here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Again, the wall is too much. I do see that now. It's too much. I did not see that when everything was white because I couldn't see anything. But that's, that's too much. I do feel like. I'm sorry about that. All right. So here's the other side of the house. Oh, I'm going into this house now. Oh, shoot. <laughs> but yeah, here's the other side of the house. And uh, I mean, the windows. Bit too much. But it's also kind of a vibe. And we are going to ignore that dormer. We're not going to talk about it. We are not. Anyways, here's the front of the house again. Magical. Magnificent. All right, let's um step inside, shall we? Oh, we shall. Oh, whoa. What is happening to the ceiling? Okay, the ceiling is supposed to be the same color as the floor. But is it the same color? No. What is happening? Did I do something wrong again? On my birthday? On my birthday party? No, it is the same color. Can I do anything about that? Or do I just have to suffer? Okay, why do I always have problems with the freaking ceiling? In every single build, I've had problems with the ceiling. Well, anyways, here is the hallway. Here's the little table with the mirror. And I'm trying not to end up in the wall, which I did. I'm gonna zoom out for you guys. There you go. The people that want total zoom out. Here you go. And here's my little light switch. These are for my close-up people. <laughs> what are we gonna do now? Step into the kitchen. <gasps> oh, okay. This is kind of cute. This I do like. Whoa. <laughs> it kind of looks like a Nordic drama series in here <laughs> with those colors. I tried to change my shader just so we can see the colors of the cabinets better. But this is, um, I mean, I feel like I'm in a crime series here. This is not the vibe. But yeah, we're back to this shader now. And, uh, you know. I don't like it. Or I don't like the shader, but I do like the kitchen. Wow. Look at all my cute little nickety knacks. Okay, let's move on from this. And um, where shall we go now? Maybe in here? Into the office? Ooh, scary Mary all around. This was very daunting. Let me do it again. Wow, still daunting. But yeah, here is the office. I kind of like it. Here's the funky nook. The funky nook. And oh my gosh, the column. The column is never where it's supposed to be. <laughs> but you know what? I'm sure. If it wants to be there, it can be there. You know? All right, let's step into another room. What can that be? The bedroom? Ooh. Do not look at the ceiling. But look. It is so cute. Okay, here's a freaking fish eye for you guys. With the ruined ceiling. And there's the other side of the room. Oh, wow. We are wow. I love the little uh, record player that's red. Oh, that is cute. Here is the other side. Oh, this is so cute, actually. Mm. Okay, let's move on. Well, now it's super bright in here. Was it always this bright? Well, anyways, here is the living room. Ooh, cute. Do not look at the ceiling. Do not look at it. Or else I'm gonna cry. There's the little TV. Oh, oh I should have had another light in here. It's kind of dark. But okay. There's the other side of the living room. Whoa. And 
the other other side of the living room <laughs> all right let's go into um the bathroom i'm not happy with the bathroom i gotta be honest here i'm i'm just not it didn't turn out how i wanted it to and why on god's green earth did i choose this toilet pourquoi okay let's uh, go into the laundry room oh wow okay i kind of like it i do i wish that the yellow was a little bit more muted but here we are you know can't get everything you want in life you really can't oh i should have elevated that a little bit more i really should have <laughs> oopsie and um i do believe that the house tour is now done here's also just some pictures of the house that will show up on the screen while i talk because i don't know where to fit this in the video so i thought right here and i you know <laughs> but um, some of you have asked me if i have other social media than youtube and i gotta be honest i'm not good with social media which is hilarious <laughs> but what i do have is a tiktok which i've had for a while now but i completely forgot about it my username is this just nora gaming so on my tiktok i really just repost what i've done on youtube just in a shorter form to get my drift that's all i do so you really don't have to follow me there you're not missing out on anything wow i am so good at promoting myself <laughs> but yeah so if you want to follow me and support what i do then you can follow me there now we'll see you on the flip side also called tiktok <laughs> now what i will also like to talk about which is so embarrassing for me actually is the fact that i start university next week and i forgot about it and you're probably thinking dora don't you already have a degree don't you already have a job yes i do <laughs> but i would very much like a little break from my job so i signed up for college university <laughs> that's what i did yeah that's the perks of having a free higher education is that you can just sign up for it whenever you need a break for something <laughs> And there you go. I don't even remember what I was supposed to study. Like, I'm not trying to be funny about this. This is not a joke. I literally cannot remember what I signed up for to study. Like, what was it? It was something about marketing. But what kind of marketing? I do not know. I have already studied market economy, which was a fun trip to have. So maybe I'm going to continue studying market economy. I hope not. Is that what I've signed up for? I have to check this out. Now I'm scared. But yeah, thankfully, this is online studies. Because I do not want the whole college university experience again. I do not. I have already experienced that two times you know i don't need that i just want to study whatever i'm was supposed to study to get a little break from my job you know <laughs> I think when you're watching this video, I've already begun my education, maybe. Okay, if I post this video on the 18th of August, I have not begun because who begins on a Saturday? But if I have posted this on the 19th, I have begun and that's sad. Well, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. <laughs> I enjoyed it. I, I do think so. And if you for some reason want to download this build, it is up on my gallery. It is. And my gallery ID is just Nora Gaming. And uh, <laughs> don't forget to like subscribe because it does really help me out. So um, thank you. But only if you want to. Only if you want to and i'll see you guys next time goodbye